it's 69 days until 4 forward slash 20 forward slash 20. How do you feel? I want to know how long you've been waiting to post this. I feel like I still love weed, but hate weed jokes forward slash culture more and more every day. Bored cause February 2nd 2020 was more cool. I thought this was our forward slash Searle Kirk at first. Like this joke is too played out. <laughs> he said the sex and the weed numbers. Every day is for forward slash 20. Don't care and won't care, as I'm not subscribed to our forward slash UPDP submissions at D. Fabs F K R G H R Vold Kind D F R B F D F at D2. Why is this my most upvoted comment? I fucking hate Reddit. I feel like this sub shouldn't allow stupid ass questions like these. Nice. Excited. Twentitober is my favorite month. I feel like haha 69 and 420 funny numbers is getting fucking annoying. Most of us don't give a sheet about the Puffhead holiday. Annoyed people still think this sheet is funny. I feel like Reddit is gonna become the infamous sheet on earth for those 24 hours. Losing more faith in humanity every time I see dumbest questions like these. I'm waiting for 4 forward slash 20 forward slash 40 20. Like I want to fucking die. 420 69 jokes are fucking atrocious. Why is Reddit like this? I'm not bothered. Removed. Kill this goddamn and funny piece of sheep meme Jesus Christ. Shouldn't it be 20 forward slash 4 forward slash 20? I don't care. I don't give a sheet. Old. Weed culture is pretty obnoxious and annoying. I don't care. He funny sex number x diabic. I could not give one fuck. This is stupid. Like him reading the post of a 13 year old. I feel that this joke is overused and it'd be great if we collectively cut this out. Let that retardation pass without notice. Puff heads are annoying. Sad because I'm pregnant. Annoyed at all those overused memes. Don't care about funny number. Jesus this post got every award. Wow. And not to be a naysayer, not to be a hater, but, honestly it's one of the dumbest questions I've ever seen asked. I feel like cannabis has given me my joy back was legalized where I live in 2018 and I had never used it before. A friend offered me a homemade edible with bud grown by his parents and I had such a wonderful night just laughing and feeling happy. I suffer from major depressive disorder, oct, severe generalized anxiety, and PTSD. I've tried 12 different meds and 5 different therapies minus I've been through the ringer and have only found moderate, temporary relief. That night was the first time in months that I actually felt like myself again. I learned I have a truly legitimate medical use for weed and my doctor agreed. Cannabis shuts off the voice in my head that repeatedly and emphatically tells me I'm a waste of space and oxygen. It makes the constant worrying stop dead, unless I'm having an especially terrible time. It lets me notice the beautiful things in life that are otherwise drowned out by mentally ill thoughts. It's not a panacea. It doesn't cure depression or anxiety or make my PTSD go away but it gives me control over my symptoms in a way I've never had before, and it does so without the intensely uncomfortable side effects I had on many antidepressants and benzodiazepines. Yes it makes me dopey sometimes and yes, I'm absolutely a stoner, but that's a small price to pay to have myself back. I have the flu and I've been pissing out of my ass no appetite, and have thrown up several times. I literally ran out of toilet paper 30 minutes ago and two friends just ran over a care package, so not so bad. Funny number, I'm deceased.
No feelings at all. It's just another day and I don't smoke. Subscribe, like and comment if you hate outros begging you to subscribe, like and comment.